In this short tutorial, you're going to learn how to give your unpainted wood furniture a stained finish. Okay, we're going to do that without using the traditional stain that's often loaded with chemicals and has you know, a lot of toxic fumes that are coming out. In fact, if you've used stain before, um, then you'll probably know it puts off a horrible smell that just doesn't go away. Even if you haul your furniture outside and uh, you know, apply the stain out there, you'll find that if you bring the furniture back inside, it just there's a smell that just lingers in your home. So what I'm going to show you right now is how to stain your furniture with a non-toxic finish. So in this tutorial, we'll be staining uh, a small wooden crate. It's just raw wood. It's unpainted. Um, and we'll be using the American Paint Company Glaze, which is a completely all-natural, non-toxic product. It doesn't have any VOCs in it, uh, but yet it still gives you the you know, nice stained look. Now, it's very easy to apply and work with. You don't need any gloves. Again, there's no smell. You can use this product right in your house. In fact, you don't even need to move your furniture. You can apply the stain right where it stands. So here's the three steps you're going to learn. Step one is just pour your glaze into a dish. Um, step two, you'll take a damp cloth and dip it into the glaze. And then step three, we'll show you how to apply um, to the surface of your wood furniture using the cloth. So we've got three colors of glaze um, available depending on what kind of look you want. We have a black glaze, a brown glaze, and a clear glaze. If you're wondering what we use a clear glaze for, uh, we cover that in another tutorial. But we'll be using the black um, to give it a nice stain in this tutorial. So let's take a closer look at the first step, which is pouring the glaze into a dish. So the APC glaze comes in a 16 ounce bottle, and so you'll just want to unscrew the cap um, and take off the protective seal that's on and then go ahead and screw the cap back on. Okay, then give it a good shake and when you're done with that, um, open up the cap and pour it into a dish, like a separate dish or a container like you see in the picture here. And you know, you can pour it straight or you can add water um, if you like you know, to go a little bit further with the product. Step two, we're going to be dipping your damp cloth into the glaze and to get a little bit of glaze on there. So you wanna use a lint-free cloth um, and then also you'll want to have it a bit damp before you dip it into the glaze. Um, we find that when you dampen the cloth a bit, it just it allows you for, you know, flow is smoother and allows to make it uh, move around the piece a little bit easier. Okay, so go ahead and when you have a damp cloth, um, dip it into the dish and get a little bit of glaze on it. Okay, so step three is applying the glaze to the surface of the wood um, using your cloth. You might want to start in the corner first so you can get a feel for it. And actually, we recommend starting out with a scrap piece of wood. That way you can really get comfortable using the product um, before starting on your furniture. Okay, once you're comfortable using the product, then go ahead and start applying the glaze to your furniture and do it in the same direction as the wood grain. And if you'd like to use a brush, that's okay too. Just depends on what you're more comfortable using and obviously how big of a piece of furniture that you have. So there you go. You can see how easy it is to turn you know, this unpainted, uh, raw wood crate into a beautifully stained piece just using the APC's um, non-toxic glaze products.